we had another video we went too long on, and we and welcome back. We had another video that went too long, so we won't be able to post that one either. But we'll just keep you updated on what we've done, and we'll recap it at the end. But right now, the Browns are right back on the clock, and we are waiting for their pick to come in. We both, and my buddy Keith and I think they're going to take a wide receiver. Uh, but with uh, the the New England Patriots took uh, Anthony uh, Jennings, offensive linebacker, Alabama. Keith, what are your thoughts on that? You think that was a good move for New England to take that one? Yeah. Yeah, and I can agree with that. Yeah, I can definitely agree with you on that, Keith. And they're in commercial right now, so I'm waiting for the draft to come back on the screen. Uh, so, uh, and uh, I want to see, and we're going to really find out who the Browns will uh, take with this uh, 88th pick in the draft. And because we've already uh, had a, we had a pick in the uh, first round, and now we we'll pick already in the second round. And I think I think that's who they're, that they're going to go with a wide receiver. And we both think that because that's what they need on the offensive side of the ball, and they need to really uh, to really uh, give give this team that'll give a team a little bit of uh, protection for Baker Mayfield. And uh, I just really think that that's what they need to have on the offensive side of the ball. And I think you would agree with me on that, Keith. I really think you I really think you agree with me on that that that, that that's what the Browns need. And, oh, go ahead. Well, I, I can just, I can, uh, I can, uh, is that the pick? Is that the pick, Keith? Oh, well. But the pick hasn't come in yet, though. Yeah. But I know the pick has not come in yet. Yeah, and I think that, that could be a good one, Antonio Golden. I think you're right. That, that could very well be a good one. And, uh... But I think we've had some pretty much picks that have not surprised us. These picks have been no surprise... And we're waiting for the draft to come back on the screen. I do apologize for another video not being able to be uploaded, but we will keep you that day. You'll get a recap at the end of all the picks. We'll have final thoughts. Do not fret. Do not worry. So, Because once again, I had some technical problems and went over the 15 minutes, and I should not have done that. Uh, but, uh, uh, we are beginning to wind down this third round of the, the, third round of the NFL draft. So uh, uh, just uh, keep with us, and uh, I think we, we think the Browns are going to take a wide receiver, and we will find out when the NFL draft comes back on the air. We're waiting for the uh, pick to uh, come in on the uh, screen. So uh, and then that will we will, and I think we're about to get it momentarily here. We're waiting. For the picker, but I think it's going to be a wide receiver. Yeah. And the Browns pick is in. We are waiting for it to come up on the screen momentarily. And I'm seeing Kevin Stefanski and Andrew Barry that are communicating uh, online with each other because we've had the social distance. And uh, normally Keith and I are together uh, down at Magnolia Clubhouse, but we have had the social distance as well. And so we are, that's why he's on the phone and I'm here online with him. But we're waiting for that pick to come in. Is on the uh, the Browns pick is not waiting for it to come up on the screen, so uh, 
And we're just... We're just waiting for it, so we will get it to you momentarily. But we both think it's going to be a wide receiver. And... Uh, Yeah, let's hope. Let's hope. Because we're waiting for that pick to come in on the screen. And we're just still waiting for it, but... Uh, I really, th we really think you and I, kid. I think you're right because we do need a wide receiver on the offensive side of the ball, and we are still waiting for that uh, pick to come in on the uh, screen. And we're hoping it comes. It will come up very uh, shortly here, and uh, and we are. And we are And uh, this is not going to be a rebuilding season for the Browns, by any means, as I mentioned last night uh, uh, during round one. And uh, this is going to be one of those years where the Browns are going to look to improve. And uh, you know, we're just we're waiting for the Browns, still waiting for the Browns pick to come in. And... Uh, Uh, and uh, oh, hold on! The selection's about to come in, and it's about to come up on the screen. And we're about to find out who it is. We'll see who it is. Uh, we're waiting for it to come up. And with the 88th pick, the Browns have selected. Jordan Elliott, defensive tackle, Missouri. Uh, what are your thoughts on that, Keith? Do you think that was a good choice for the Browns to take uh, to take that uh, defensive tackle? Do you think that was a good choice, Keith? What are your thoughts? What do you think? Yeah, I think you're right. That very well could be. But that, that'll that be on the defensive side of the ball. And the uh, Minnesota Vikings are back on the clock with the 89th pick. And uh, the Browns' next pick will come in the third round at uh, pick uh, 115 they have. So, in the fourth round, excuse me. Yeah, they, he did. He very much did. You're right, Keith. And uh, and I think it was a good move for the Browns to take Jordan Elliott. And uh, I really think uh, this is going to be help the defense out a lot. Yeah. Yeah, and I can agree with you on that wholeheartedly. Yes, and uh, they lacked that last year. And uh, Minnesota's pick is in, and I went. And the, the selection's about to come up on the screen. Uh, and it is uh, Cameron Densler, uh, cornerback, Mississippi State. Cameron Densler, that's who it is. Quarterback, Mississippi State. And, uh, Keith, what are your thoughts on that? Do you think that was a good move by uh, Minnesota to take that pick, to take Cameron uh, Densler? What are your thoughts on that, Keith? Keith, you're still there, buddy? Okay, what are your thoughts on uh, 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 Minnesota taking Cameron Densler, CB, out of cornerback out of uh, Mississippi State? Well, I think that's a good move. I think that's a good move. Uh, 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 I think that's
Yes, indeed. They are. You're exactly right. And uh, the Houston Texans are, are back on the clock, and their pick is in. And I think that uh, Houston is going to go with a running back. What, what do you think, Keith? Because I think Houston uh, could use a running back. Yeah. Yeah, and I think you're right. I think you're exactly right. But I guess I still think they're going to go with a running back, and I think you think they're going to go with an offensive tackle. But I think with uh, with the Browns, with their pick, their pick one fifteen in the fourth round, I think it needs to be a wide receiver, and I think you're going to agree with me on that. And I'm going to have to Texas selection has come in. Hold on a minute. They've taken Jonathan Greenard, offensive linebacker, Florida. What do you think, Keith? Uh, to Texas taking a... Uh, yeah, they took Jonathan Greenard, offensive uh, linebacker from Florida. Yeah. And do you think that was a good move by the Texans to take that one? True, and uh, uh, and uh, oh, the Raiders uh, had the the uh, Las Vegas Raiders had the 91st pick, and they have now traded that one to the New England Patriots. So it looks like uh, New England's back on the clock now. It's the New England Patriots with the 91st pick. And uh, so they're on the clock right now. I think you're right. We, I th they, well, I don't know if uh, New England's going to want to take a quarterback in the draft. I don't think that, I don't know if that's such a good move because uh, they just lost Tom Brady, but they do need a quarterback that can really uh, that can really uh, 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 help uh, play, be a. Uh, uh, be as good as Tom as Tom Brady was, or not, if not even better. But I, I don't, I don't think they're going to want to take a quarterback with this draft. I don't know. We're going to have to wait and see. And uh, and the pick is in, so we're going to. I'm waiting for it to come up on the screen uh, momentarily. Uh, and uh, we've got just a, a, a minute and thirty five seconds left. So I may have to take a break when it gets to 14 minutes, but I want to uh, wait for this pick to come in. But uh, I just think, uh, I don't know. I think the one is going to want to take, a, I think, probably, I'm going to say a linebacker because I think that's, but their selection has come in. Uh, I want to get it just quickly. I'm hoping it's going to come up on the screen quick so I can get this out because I, this selection in quickly. Uh... And it is Devin Asai, tight end, UCLA. That's who it is. Yeah. Yes, it will. It definitely will. And I, and I, I, I can agree with you on that. So I think that was a good move by New England. I think it was. Uh, I really, it's hard to say. Uh, but Keith, I might have to cut you off because we're going to have to take a break because I've only got 30 seconds left, so we'll be right back. Stay with